Hi there and welcome back to Dimples World. It's time for another exciting chapter from the amazing Durga Shaptashati. Today my friends we're going to be exploring chapter 8, the battle of the Shaktis. We've got a super cool adventure waiting for you so let's dive right in. Once upon a time in a land far far away there was a gigantic battle going on between the gods and some really, really angry demons. The big boss demon was named Shumba and he was super mad. Shumba was so angry that he gathered a massive army of other demons to fight against the gods. They were in for a big showdown. Earlier in the battle, two demons named Chanda and Munda got defeated and lots of demon armies were wiped out. But guess what? Shumba, their leader, was still super duper angry and determined to win. So Shumba, the mighty demon leader, ordered all his demon friends to get ready for the war. There were 86 demons with their armies, 84 groups called Kambas, 50 demon families known as Kativiryas, and 100 families called Damuras. That's a whole lot of demons getting ready for a big battle. Shumba and his massive demon army marched forward, ready to take on the gods. When the gods saw this um, scary army coming their way, a super powerful goddess named Chandrika stepped up to the plate. Chandrika had a friendly lion by her side, and when she pulled her bowstring, it made a loud noise. Her lion roared like a champ and another goddess named Ambika rang a bell to make even more noise. Kali, another goddess, opened her mouth wide open and made loud sounds that drowned out everything else. The super angry demon army surrounded Chandrika, her lion, and Kali from all sides. But then Something incredible happened. Just at that very moment, special beings called Shaktis popped out from the bodies of gods like Brahma, Shiva, Gahu, Vishnu, and Indra. These Shaktis looked just like the gods and they were all set to join the battle. Brahmani, who came from Brahma, arrived in a heavenly chariot drawn by swans carrying a rosary and a pot. Maheshwari, another Shakti, rode on a bull and held a trident. She looked super strong. Ambika Kumari, who resembled Guha, had a cool spear and rode a beautiful peacock. Other Shaktis came to looking just like the gods they came from. All these Ashrama Shaktis fought like champions to help the gods. Shiva, surrounded by these mighty beings, told Chandrika to teach the demons a lesson. A super fierce Shakti popped out from Chandrika's body. This Shakti was as loud as a hundred jackals and became known as Shiva's messenger. She had a message for the two haughty demon leaders, Shumba and Nishumba. She told them that they should stop fighting and let the gods have the three worlds. But if they still wanted to fight, the Shaktis were ready to give them a run for their money. The demons got really, really angry when they heard this message and went to fight against a goddess named Katyayani, and that's where the real action started. Chandrika uses her bow to shoot down the demon's weapons and Kali, with her spear and skull-topped staff, fought like a superhero. Brahmani used her special water to weaken the demons. Maheshwari swung her trident like a pro 
and Vaishnavi threw her discus. Kumari showed off her javelin skills and Aindri struck the demons with her thunderbolt. They were all incredible. But there was one tricky demon named Rakta Bija. Every time a drop of his blood touched the ground, a new demon would pop up. Wow, what a problem, right? Chandrika had a genius plan though. She asked Kali to drink up Rakta Baji's blood before it hit the ground and Kali just did that. No more new demons were born. Chandrika then gave Rakta Baji a taste of her dart and Kali splurred up his blood. Rakta Baji tried to hit Chandrika with his club but it didn't even tickle her. Wherever Rakta Baji got hurt, his blood flowed and Chamunda drank it all. She even munched on the demons that came from Rakta Baji's blood. What a feast! Chandrika also used her thunderbolt, arrows, swords and spears to give Rakta Baji a run for his money. In the end, Rakta Baji hit the ground and the gods were all over the moon with joy. They danced and celebrated their victory and that's where our incredible story ends. It's the story of how the mighty goddess Chandrika and her powerful Shaktis defeated the tricky demon Rakta Baji and brought peace to the world. Wow, what an epic battle, my friends. If you've enjoyed this thrilling chapter, give us a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, and don't, don't forget to subscribe to Dimples World for more exciting adventures. My friends, don't forget to spread love and compassion wherever you go. See you in the next episode.